welcome to Buzz, Indiana's Underground Business Voice. I've got Dorothy Pergola with Max International here in studio, Evansville, Indiana. We, Dave and I got up at 5.30 this, well, we actually got up at 4 to make it here, uh, for our time, to make it here on time. And um, uh, one police, one ticket later from the uh, uh, oh. friendly state of Indiana. But I think we're good. I got a rainmaker who's going to take care of it. It's all good. It's all good? Yep. All right. So, but you're Max International. I, you know, it's one of those nutraceuticals is what right. we're calling them. Right. What does that mean? What does nutraceutical mean? A nutraceutical is something that it's a nutrient nutritional supplement, mm -hmm. but it has the grade of what you would find in a pharmaceutical. Okay. For instance, our products are um, composite patent. They have a composite patent on them, which okay. is normally reserved okay. for pharmaceuticals. Um, the interesting thing about it is the creator of the Max GXL uh -huh. and uh, his predecessor that has come to the company as well now, they have these patents that they are not willing to give to pharmaceutical companies mm -hmm. because typically what happens with a pharmaceutical company is you have to be sick. So in order for you to get the benefit of what they've discovered, you've got to have a specific illness. Mm. I'm a healthy individual. I'm a healthy individual and I don't have illnesses. Mm -hmm. So the chance of me going to the doctor and being prescribed this wonderful supplement that yeah. has helped me tremendously. Well, they're not, they're not being trained, doctors aren't being trained by, I mean, are, doctors are being trained by pharmaceutical companies to prescribe drugs because they're the ones that have the audience, right? Well, you know, I take a different standpoint behind that. I think the doctors are doing what they have to do right now, which is treating people that are sick. Mm -hmm. And the people that really are going to benefit from a, from, a, from a supplement like this are people that yeah want to be educated in how to maintain their health. Prevent rather than react, so to yes. speak. Okay. Yes. So so you were talking, you were saying that, that a lot of what um, you basically help people do is deal with their general dehydration. Is that one of the now, things? No, it's just that people will understand that by absence of one thing, water, mm -hmm. your body can just really deteriorate. Okay. We understand that. Sure. What we have a hard time believing is, is all that, the other stuff? No. We have a hard time believing that it is possible that you can do one thing to enjoy better health. Oh yeah. You'll believe that you can do one thing to screw up your health. Yeah. But people are very skeptical that there's one thing yeah. that I can do to make myself feel twenty years younger. So your one thing is you help them bring on a new habit that makes them feel better every day, which is getting a supplement that they can ingest on an ongoing basis that makes them feel improve their general quality of life. It definitely. And and my what I want people to understand is that the interesting thing about it is for me when I started taking it, mm -hmm. um, I noticed a, a complete a complete better well and a, a better. I felt better about myself. It was easier to be me. So Denise, one of the things that Dorothy. I always uh, uh, Dorothy, okay. I'm sorry. That's I, okay. I got it wrong again. You That's gave me a hard time. You know, for I, yeah. I mean, that, that, we've done this before. We have. All right. Just before we were on camera. That's all right. So, Dorothy. Yes. All right. I got that right. Yes. Um, I, I just got to keep click red shoes, click red shoes. <laughs> we, uh, every, you know, the hard question that I have to ask you yeah. is what is your niche so we can make a really good strategic relationship? My niche is any, for me personally, mm -hmm. is someone that wants to learn more about what we offer. I mean, I, people that want to be well. What do they look like? Are they are they more more men, more women, more? Are they? Do they tend to be more affluent? Do they tend to be poor? Help me help me draw me a picture I, of what your it, ideal client looks really like. It's really not a demographics. Yeah. It's a state of mind. Okay. I need somebody that is that so, wants to learn and yeah. that wants that is open minded enough to believe. So, so maybe they they're are, already spending money on developing themselves personally. Maybe they they're already be. engaged in a coaching. Maybe they're already dealing with wellness. Maybe they're already using alternative medicine rather than traditional route. Maybe they're they're looking for other ways to create that being. That's but their but their mindset is that they're, they're they have a psychographic rather than a demographic. Exactly. Does that make sense? Yes. Because what we've got to do is make it easy for everybody else to help you. Right. And the and the clear picture we draw on who they're going after that that makes it easy for them to help. Does that make sense? Right. Cool. So so I would say like you know I would look at the people that I've got involved in the business and I'd say what are the common threads and the mm -hmm. characteristics? There's always a ghost behind the machine. Right. If we can find that ghost, we can replicate it, and then we can really create strategic relationships. Like that. There's your homework. You've been bust. <laughs>